today. There is a new development tonight in the fight against the opioid epidemic. South Carolina's Attorney General Alan Wilson says his office is investigating whether companies that make the drugs have done anything illegal and how they've marketed them. Our Capitol reporter Robert Kittle has all the details. There's not a lot the Attorney General can say because this is an ongoing investigation, but he did tell me that South Carolina is joining other states that are also looking into this. South Carolina got involved last fall, and the investigation involves a majority of the states. They're all looking into what role the opioid manufacturers and others played in creating or prolonging the epidemic. Just from 2011 to 2015, there have been almost 3,300 deaths due to opioid overdoses. Attorney General Alan Wilson says it's a complex issue, but here's an example of what they're investigating. A drug is created for, for this particular issue, but in order to get a larger market share, the company tries to sell it for, for, for things that it wasn't originally created for after they've discovered that that is not a healthy option. One of the big questions is, at what point did drug manufacturers know how addictive opioids are, and did they ignore that or downplay it when marketing it to consumers? In Columbia, Robert Kittle, 7 News. The Attorney General would not name any targets of this investigation right now. Uh, he says fighting the epidemic is going to take a combined effort by law enforcement, lawmakers, healthcare professionals, even all of us really, educating ourselves about how to avoid addiction.